Doom Patrol, Season 1, ep- Episode 15, the final episode of this season. Escarol, Escarol Patrol, Transcript. Can you hear me, Mr. Morden? A dissociated voice, yes. Mr. Nobody, cue the recap. Paraguay, Valkyrie, made me this way. A harbinger of chaos brought to make this geezer pay. I stung around. The dumb patrol flipped the bus into a hole, slammed it shut. Wait, what? Stuffed it up a donkey's butt. See if any sign of the chief. We know he's alive. Mr. Nobody, a team was forged with one belief to stop at nothing and get their chief. Nazi beating, doomsday cheating, bear, beard, hair eating, romance hating, punk to skunk, robot chunk. Flashback da- back dancing with a hunk, gator baiting, half cub dating, swimming through a metal grating, death cult all around, Jane survived the underground, up. Oh. I ain't farm. <coughs> <coughs> no, he harmed the living justice with a swarm. No, Mr. Nobody. Father doing, doing, doting, hand exploding. Pain is skewered for secret coding. Growing close with each endeavour. Finally, they came together, all moaning loudly. Mr. Nobody, but I grew bored with this game of chase and track them inside the white space. Back their chief against the wall, forcing him to spill it all. I was responsible for anything that like everything that happened to you, each of you, Mister Mobley. This is the best timeline ever. This Corel Patrol. Why? I needed you. I wanted you. What you have in mortality, Cliff? What? I needed to. Wanted to. I needed to. Cliff, motherfucker, crying. Nulls. I'm so sorry, Jane. Laughing. Liar. You lied to Jane. You lied to all of us. Yelling. Please let him go. What do you take me for, Niles? It was never about them. This was never about them. Making silly putty on their fragile, fractured brains. Well, that was all just extracurricular. Consider them abandoned conquests. The future isn't in their own their own now. God, I wonder what they do with it. Hmm? What does it a family do when they realise that they're no family at all? They're just rats in the neighbouring cages. They're just putri dishes on the same shelf. You know, I huffed and I puffed, but it was you all along, wasn't it, Niles? You destroyed them, just like you destroyed Eric Morden. You had your, you, so you've had your revenge. What now? Nothing. Why? Sky's limit, old friend. I'm going to conduct a parade. I'm going to get host of you. I'm going to become the next bachelor. The world's going to a golden oyster for me now. But for you, Niles Chandra, I have a a story that's a little different. I've been waiting decades to ask you this. How does it feel to be a nobody? Laughing manically. Man on tip PA. Security containment block seven. All security containment block seven. Good morning, Joshua. Bureau and astronomers have confined, confirmed your calculations. Next week's X-15 test flight is our, our clearest shot to yet to invest, accept the space anomaly. Now, you are very, very good then. Meaning we have not this how do we knock this pilot from the sky? Your name is Larry Taylor, by the way. Larry, Captain Larry Taylor. Wife, two kids. Are we exposed him to unknown space matter? Are we potentially burning him in beyond the known limits of human capability? capability? We're going to hand him over to Foresight and his animals for what? Foresight will grow bored of his new toy. It'll be ours, hopefully forever. Your Ultras project is working. Rita Farr has, sh- has shown zero signs of aging since 1955. We have a perfectly good test subject. Now we have two. Where's the mine, Niles? Because I can't see it anymore. The only thing that should trouble you, Joshua, is alternative. Except I don't know what the alternative is. The only way I sleep at night is because you tell me nothing. You're right. You're welcome. Groaning. Oh, God. Sniffles. Rita humming. Good morning, Larry. Larry. Rita. Larry. Apparently it is. Rita continues humming. I've been looking forward to the, all, this all day, this day, all semester. My students are finally performing their STEAM, students, their STEAM studies. I can't wait to see how they utilise the techniques I taught them. 
Mm's, I expect they'll be handing out a lot of A's. We the hums. Uh-huh. Feels so good to be back, get back to community. We shouldn't have done this ages ago. What? Moved on. Think so ago, we learned our lives have been destroyed by madmen. Excuse me if it takes more than a moment to get back on my sea legs. We moved into this place. We made a promise to each other. I know, but no more hiding. I know. I'm trying. Mm. Size, okay. What do you think? You're gonna try for you're gonna we'll try for twenty seconds this time. Stop watch ticking. Breathe deeply. Negative spirit release. Groans. Breathing heavily. Huh? Size. There you go, buddy. We can do this. We can do this. We can hit the bricks, sister. We've all done. Finito. You don't don't mean that, Carl. I know you better than you know yourself. You wanna pick up the up the O's. You wanna pick me up in those large strong arms cut to your throat. Jagger, SML, you failed to move your audience. We didn't feel it because you didn't feel it. Mm. Let me show you what it looks like when you really connect to your character. Clean to close throat and action. Hit the brick, sister. We're done. Finito. You don't really mean that, Carl. Mm. I know you want it better than you know yourself. You want to pick me up with those strong arms of the valley hole and see. And that, children chuckles, is a serious dedication. What serious dedication to your craft gets you? Being a shitty high school drama teacher. Wow, dare to dream. Students laughing. It's not s- scary. Not to itself at anything we aspire to do, isn't it? It's not scary not to itself at, at something we aspire to do, isn't it? Yes, may. Yes, may. I'm not selling. I can't think of anything sadder than some washed up never was. It gets a jolly of out acting a bunch of teenagers. Took this class for an easy A. Students laughing, shake your body. Booty, playing on TV, humming. Larry, hurry up, we're missing a booty song. Now, do you, do any of you two want to buy maybe in gardens? Honestly, I could use the cash. Mm, Larry, this is absolutely unacceptable. 1976 is ending, and you're still stalling. Like some trend, too excellent schoolboy. Grass, knuckle, nose, chuckles. Oh, now I believe it's your turn, Larry. Uh, I look ridiculous. No, Rita laughing. Now then, Rita, what's, that's not fair. Both laughing. Oh, yeah, sure, laugh it up. Doggo ringing. Rita exclaims, all right, keep playing. And don't t- cheat. We're talking to you. Talking to you, Larry. Ha <laughs> ha. Door closes, four steps approaching, full sight. What the hell are you doing here? Wonderful home, Dr. Chanda. And a happy New Year's Year's Eve. You need to leave. Oh, I'm afraid the matter at hand is rather urgent. What is it? What is it? You know, when the brass told me in 68 we'd be losing Captain Dana to a mortis pro initiative, I have to say, I couldn't have imagined this new assignment would be so, be quite so cosy. Hmm. Well, you have your methods, I have mine. The work we do here is just as essential. Yes, I see that now. Music continues playing. What is that song? My daughter likes that one. Cut the bullshit, urgent. What's that? Well, I can't believe it. I, well, I believe it. You once called it a relenting conference in pursuit of truth. The signature is required, Doctor. I investigate and divide the, your next test subject. What are you talking about? I never. The request was made over a decade ago. Now we found a Hispanic female, multiple personality disorder. By all counts, a weird wildcat. I think you agree. She fits perfectly the profile you asked us to find. Groaning, but bell ringing. Students chattering. Jane, did you know about you, what? About about what that sarcastic fuck did to us? You're fucking. Jane grasped. No, no. We promise. You promise. Crying loudly. Jane, wearily. Jane, it's okay. Hey, it's okay. Disordered. He's going, he was going to cage us here, here. cage us like the rest of them. Wasn't it? Wasn't it? Seeing cage bit birdies with pretty feathers for the master to pluck, beaming heavily. It's okay, it's okay. Just tell me, please. I knew. I just give you the spiel, but the truth is I was blind, willfully blind. I need, to make it, I need you to go make it go away. I know it's difficult. You don't know. I keep having this dream. I find a wound on my chest. It's all wound that's scabbed over. I know I shouldn't touch it. But I keep scra- reaching for it. I can't help but scratch. And the wound gets bigger and bigger. And, it, and then until there's nothing left of me, there's a dragon open my For mega human powers. No, I created it. Gave it to me for safekeeping so he wouldn't 
you tempted the keypad leaping is not a fix or cure it claims that night it calms the noise and makes it more, more manageable but it's not it doesn't discriminate jane it doesn't it quiets everything the good and the bad in order to use it safely we have to stick to a strict broke regime at a monitor your doses vitals i'm sorry Kay. it's okay it feels better now now sobbing eleanor Niles? Huh? Eleanor? Eleanor? Thank you for coming. This is my latest research student subject. He was a race car driver. Father, husband, afraid that all, afraid all that. He's hitting me the hardest of all. Crash was supposed to be on the racetrack. No one else was, was to get hurt. No one what? What does that mean? He was supposed to? How would you know that a man was supposed to crash? It's all gone too far. All gone too far, Eleanor. I used to think I had no alternative. It was an alternative. No, it was an alternative. But it's gone too far now. So I love you as a mentor and a friend. But you're scaring the ever living fuck out of me right now. I need to tell you something. I want you to promise that when it's finished, that you'll still be my friend. Eleanor sighs. Cock, cock. Cliff, you fold us up. Yo, old hunking. You think the announcement on PA. Now, you know how much I care for Eleanor. She would have wanted it this way, for Victor to survive. There's more, com- there's more some comfort in that. So that's cold comfort. But thank you. Now, if I if I may, one piece of advice. There's one thing I learned from my research, Victor. Gonna need some special care. No offence, but he's, we're not talking about homeschooling the son's recovery here. Dar Labs has it covered. I'm not talking about technology facilities. It's a realistic component to be considered. Patience, empathy. Not capable of giving it. Is that what you're saying? No, I just suggest you might be surprised how much of the tonic compassion would be. Exactly, who do you think you're fooling here? Hmm, you talk about compassion and empathy, like you invented it. I, I was a husband. You think she told me what you, told me what you did? You think you were standing, have any standing to lecture me about family? I put my son back together, my son. You think you and I are the same? You think what you did? What I did are the same. This was a, this wasn't some experiment. I turned my sweet, affordable, available, athletic, charming, delicious boy into a freak of nature. I did it for lo- out of love. Why the hell did you do it, Niles? To those people, you speak to me about compassion. Don't ever, don't you dare screaming, screaming, continued Vic. Who are you, man? Me? I'm you. Crackles, laugh, screaming, panting, phone ringing. Hey, Dad. Silas, you okay, son? Fine, huh? Been up all night working the Bitcoin ring. Well, you know, it's a cybercrime. It's too dry for you. You can always go back to, out to the field. My time's better spent taking down international morning orders than two bit purse snatchers. What do you f- do, do, don't, don't you think? Of course. Either way, I'm proud of you. Hope you know that. Sure. Look, I'm going to get it back. Hangs up, panting. Look, hey, look, I've got to get back to it. Hangs up, panting, dance music playing, blowing, laughing, blowing, laughing. Is there any sweeter feeling than revenge? Chuckles. This is excellent. That's as an excellent question would be. I don't think there is. A new thing that I'm sure of is that it'll never, ever, ever go away. Groaning, a cavoted, murdering plot that ends in a whimper. An impotent villain with a cheesy approach to revenge. You know what? What? He's right. You're totally right. He's totally right. Iskrill, at long last I have found you. Is it me? Yelping? No. Iskrill, be still, you fidgeter. Fidgeter, be still, I say. Did you just call me fidgeter? Silence, Fiskrunt. This is, for well, this is my time. I will you centuries for the rapture, foretold in the scripture. Twice you brought it us to the brink. Twice you have failed. Explain yourself, I demand it. I was going for more of your personal tale of vengeance and betrayal. You know, emotional stakes. Premium, real premium cable shit. Iskrill, so you're not an agent of the Lord? No, there is no God. If there was, I wouldn't be so devoid of purpose. Iskrill, oh, a crisis of faith. This is why Father has led me to you, to set you f- back on the path of his glory. Path to glory? Oh, like I, I like the sound of that, Iskrill. To his glory? Yeah, that's what I said. To glory. 
Ah, oh, but there's no use. I'm afraid. I've already completed my life's advice by, by telling everyone in the Nile's called of loves against him. There isn't a person alive that can he can call friend. No woman, no man, no woman. Woman? Muttering fast smoke for me. I want the truth. Where is she? Grunts. Seems me as though I le- left some vengeance on the table. I've really got to amp things up this time. Really make a show of force. This girl, you need guys. I know right. I spent an entire afternoon exacting revenge on a robot who killed his mother. Mr. Nobody? Admiral Whiskers? I love that guy. Squeaking. Chuckles. This is a splendid start. Who else? This girl. Mm, you know what? Let's start small with Trinity. Mm, I like it. It's like a major resist. And shall we call it, what shall we call ourselves? The Brotherhood of Dangerous Animals. Iskrill, Hosanna, Emerald Whiskers, squeaking. Yes, it's tight, Emerald Whiskers. Yes, and vengeance will be mine. Again, for real this time. And when we get those children again, the world will be ours, laughing. Iskrill, then we shall destroy it. Maybe, if there's time, all laughing manically, yawns, whispers, sighs, whispers, cheerful tune. Morning, dear, sighs. We hit 20 seconds yesterday. At least I think we did. I passed out at some point, but it felt longer. But if you, really rough day at school, I was mostly assassinated by a 13-year-old girl. I'm not even sure what we're doing here, Larry. We're doing exactly what we're doing back at the, what we were doing back at the manor, just getting by. It's not enough for me, not anymore. There has to be more to life than this. This embodied voice. We'll be singing. We'll be, when we'll be winning, we'll be singing, neighbours. Move next week, last week. We'll be singing. We'll be singing when we're winning. Do you think old man Arnold can hear it? Hear that what? Nothing. Have a nice day now. Old man Arnold. Eat shit, Ginger. He'll be singing. Larry, this a body singing, singing. Reader, never a good sign. No, we could follow it. See where it, it, it leads. Not, not like we have much to lose. No, just our lives. But hey, we're living on stolen time anyway. So I might not take it for granted and dive headlong into shark festive waters that would undoubtedly lead us back to the man who perfectly disfigures us, disfigures us and lied to us about it for decades. We're the ones who don't get involved, remember? We'll be singing, no more hiding. We'll be singing, Larry sighs, faint singing. Kay giggles, Larry, Jane, Kay, stay here. Man, sweet baby, sweet Sweet baby. Who's there? Jane. No, Kay, don't forget. You can't forget. I'll get her, Jane. Don't worry, Kay. And Red, come here, monkey. Man, sweet, sweet baby. Secretary, I know you think this is how it has to be. But this isn't healing, Jane. Forgetting and hiding isn't healing. You have to go up. I can't. We're safer here. We're happier. We're happy, aren't we? Grass, I get not down again playing. And you're gonna get gonna you're never gonna knock me down. I get knocked down, but I'll get I get knocked down, but I'll get up again. And you're never gonna get me keep me down. Jane, what the fuck? Yo Cliff Yelps, uh huh. Uh hi, what the fuck? You're the one who's been been who's been bringing me cold food all this whole time for months, huh? Well yeah, when it's not busy, I'm busy a lot, you know. It just happens to be in a food truck when I'm busy at most, and I am. Um, I mean, it's not like I could eat it, any of it. Thanks. Music continues playing. Cliff won't be a bit soggy. A trip to manhole just came out of a... Do you hear the music too? All morning. You, uh, you want to go fuck up while we was playing it? Yeah, fuck. Fuck, yeah. But I get up again. I get knocked down again. Continues playing. I get knocked down, but I get up again. You're never going to keep me down. They'll get knocked down, but they can get up again. You're never going to keep me down. Pissing the night away, pissing the night away. He drinks a whiskey drink. He drinks a vodka drink. He drinks a lager drink. He drinks a blood cider drink. He sings the songs that remind me of him, the good times. Cliff, so, by the time I might be shit here, but for me, but, but I, for one, am grateful that disembodied Trevor Wamba has brought us all back together. Larry groans. I get knocked down, but I get up again. I get knocked down, but I get up again. And they never keep me down. I get knocked down, but I get up again. And you're never going to keep me down. I get knocked down. Can you I just say, there better be good fucking reason why we're here. Why we're here. 
and it better be to turn that f- off that fucking song. Cliff lowers volume. Because honestly, I'd rather stick sharks in my vagina than be on the same zip code as you. Mr. Nobody, he's kidnapped Danny. So rest, so Danny, I can't. I need your help. A long time ago, I had a daughter. She's extraordinary. Everything, everything to me. I'm afraid she's in danger to all of us. All I ever, all I ever wanted was to live long, one day longer than she did. Protect her, protect of us. That's why I created each one of you. Size, I need you to study any means possible to stay in my own life. So we are just lap rats, just like Mr. Lowy said at first. I can't deny that. Very okay, I'm sorry. Revoking your daughter in the nail. It's fucking evil. It's the truth. I hid her for, year, for years and Danny. A grace she accepted to be a caretaker. Somehow Mr. Lowy has found out about her. We trapped them both inside this painting. Please. She's all I've got left. Tell you what. Hope you with your daughter. As soon as you invent the time machine that gets me back the thirty years I lost with mine. Till then, fuck you forever. And Danny, you're just gonna turn your back on them? Even though they had no part no part on this? I say what part to fuck you forever was in Hebrew? I'll do it. For Danny, even your daughter. Grass, not for you. Cliff, wait, you're doing this? No, Chanda, you're an awful vermin infested garbage person. But so help me, I'm going into this painting too. I was terrible as a human being, even worse as an acting teacher. Any time I didn't feel like a complete arsehole when dealing with whatever you call this foolishness. Larry, Larry, does my, does my opinion even matter? Cliff, great, now I'm a fucking arsehole. Well, who's a fucking arsehole if I don't walk into a fucking, a fucking painting? Of course I'm going to fucking walk into the fucking painting. Because let me be honest, who the fuck else is... It is enough of ours, fucking arsehole, to walk into a fucking painting. Let's go. Okay. Let's get so get in so get into painting somehow, then rescue Danny, your daughter somehow. Getting in is gonna be the easy part. It's getting out, it's gonna be tricky. Larry, why? What did we have to do? I don't know. That's why it's gonna be tricky. Larry, oh, okay. I got net down again playing. So what do we do? Just stare at this thing? Keep staring, keep staring. I get not down again, continue playing. Where is everyone? Electronic bleep. Cliff, Danny, you okay? What's that going? What's going? Oh, I can't see, all right. Danny, what about her? She's safe. Electronic bleep. Have you such such approaching? Ah, uh, guys, what the hell is that? That? Icarel, Iskarel. Here comes your reckoning, oh my God. Iskarel, behold, I am his right hand, he's safe. Use me, father, I am your disciple. The fifth horseman, take cover, Mr. Shit, 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 Crying, oh, Danny boy, Danny boy. I'm so sorry, Danny boy. Oh, my God, Danny was right. You came. I'm so happy to see you guys. Man, what the hell are you doing? Grunts, rumbling. I fucked up, I fucked up. I fucked up so hard. I was happy, you know. This guy shows up, Mr. Nobody, offering me bags of Lincoln, Da Vinci, to ZZ Top. His beard tastes, those beards taste as good. I told him, I told him everything, crying. You saw the way up, cop, pull, cop, 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 pops. What did I, you do? Why, what did I do? I mean, sure, I tracked down into this goddamn painting but before realising that it would turn me into this husk. All I wanted to do was to meet the Cro-Magnon squeeze of yours. And lo and behold, all that remains is adorable, mighty chip of the old block. If you, so much, if you do so much, if you so much as harmed hair of her head, rumbling, she enlarged those two f- bat sapping vermin. Have you ever tried talking sense of pest while he enjoys his own reenactment of the Kulu movie? It's impossible. Shut up, look, we need a plan. Look, we're the only people in this whole entire world who got Danny's SOS and we followed it here. We're standing inside the heart of the Sentiment Street, inside a magic painting with a giant ass cockroach. A guy who hunts beards and an interdimensional fuck up, rumbling, burps. So, well, if anyone's going to save Danny and the chief's daughter, it's going to be us. Fine, what's the plan? No, this way, quickly. He's in the dollhouse down the stairs, Cliff. That isn't so bad. Maybe the giant roach found a giant turd to trail down and forgot all about us, growling, heavy foots approaching. It's the roach, isn't it? Growling continues, sniffing. 
Oh, fuck my life. Jenny ran, screaming. The fuck? Ever whiskers. Ever the whiskers roaring. No, I going Come on, get it, arsehole. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Now find my daughter. A doll hospital. Go, grunting, rumbling. I'm supposed to be the villain of this shitty piece. I've been bested by a little girl. Thrown out of my own criminal organization. My rat, a roach, me, the big hat, the big, the black, big bad, <coughs> black hat. You can't make this shit up. Yesterday, a the old girl told me to fuck my face. With wee whacker, laughing, rumbling. Greg should we both suck. That's the one way to tell the story. It's the truth in the past. It's the past. Future is still yours for the making. Why? What's the point? I know what it's like to be a nobody. But as bad as that felt, I'd rather be nobody than nothing. And that's exactly what you're going to do be if you don't quit feeling sorry for yourself. And don't give a sh- you don't give a shit about me. You're only saying all this to save your own stitches. Rumbling. That is 100% true. But you think about it this way. If you give up, your story is forgettable, disappointing defeat. And if you give, take up if you take up your narration once again, you can turn the tale and inhales something beloved by all told and retold time after time I come back. What do you want me to do? It's cruel. Give me joy in my heart, keep me praising. Give me joy in my heart, I pray. With a really kill his throat. There he stood anointed with a purpose, O Skrill. Born to most heavenly and a timeless of creatures. Israel, father, is that you? Mr. Mobody, no. Israel realised it wasn't God. It couldn't be, because he was God all along. Israel, huh? Oh, who else was more powerful than a cockroach? Who else has survived mass extinction, plagues, and nuclear explosions? Israel, no one. Only I, Israel. Mr. Mobody, but if he wanted him again, he should have. He would have to manifest revelations himself. Yes, I am ready, Mr. Mobody. Now was the time for the meat to inherit the earth. The time for the meat to devour it. Devour it? Ah, Mr. W, three o'clock behind the BMW. Why? A guard would not be stated on scraps of green oak owner alone. His girl had no appetite, a desire to eat. Yelps the world, psycho screaming. His girl, yes, Mr. W. Now having tasted the great psycho, his girl's craving for how it grew. His girl, I am become a guard. Destroy the wells, his girl crackling. As if of all the stupid ways to expect to die, be one because I've ever racked, never made a list. I don't know, maybe I deserve this. I was a shitty dad and a worse husband. Oh, let's see what else. Rumbling. Emily Whisker squeaking. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah. But those those two other things, they aren't that bad. Rumbling. Emily Whisker squeaking. I mean, lots of people suck in relationship parenting. Doesn't mean they're sucky people, does it? Because if it, I had another chance of clear, I know I'd be to do so much better. So why shouldn't I get a second chance? Why do I deserve to slowly do, be, be slowly digested by a giant fucking rodent? Because I don't think I, I could. I do. I don't fucking deserve this. Maybe nobody does. I am not. don't deserve this shit. Rambling. I do not deserve this shit. I do not deserve this shit. I have no risk of sniffing. Are you okay? You you heard Vic's plan. You're gonna hide us. You're gonna find us a way to, out of here. I know you are. They're gonna see it released, groaning, braving heavily. Dorothy sobbing. Door door knob rattles. Hello, I'm Jane. No one sent me to come get get you. Now bang grunts. Good job. Looks like I'm up. Just as soon as everyone inside the joint uh, cockroach Rita breathes deeply. I know you better than you know yourself, it's grill. You want to pick me up with those strong arms and devour me whole? Oh, God, this could be worse than that than donkey's donk, donkey, isn't it? Really screaming. Jane, I'll get it. I have a but, but girl, friend, baby dog. She's like us. She gets scared, too. And your daddy used to sing her song. Always made her feel better. A vigilant little squirrel. I'm brave and powerful. No, I'm not afraid of anything at all. Door opens. I'm strong and I'm a darling. Not me that you'd be scaring. No, I'm not afraid of anything at all. No, but even a hawk with his loud and mighty squawk. Come, dear, shall we see what's inside a cockroach looks like? Wait, Cliff, what about Cliff? Mr. Nobody, oh shit, Cliff, I, did not, I do not deserve this shit. No, gross. Mr. Nobby, ah, uh, okay, okay, I'm just vamping fam- fam- here. Then Cliff out, and this girl noticed whiskers. I mean, he really noticed him. 
why he had been so busy with coming to Alcatech the Gulpolis, and all he failed to see that right before his eyes. There he was, Esco's right hand in abstraction, his loathsome world, another meek and forgotten creature. As if their soul was split in two, they were finding their way back together again. The yearning was palpable. It's intoxicating, you have a whiskers shrieking. Isco, really? Oh, whiskers. Miss Ellery, is at that moment Isco lost all his other appetite. He hungered for one thing and one thing only. That was Ratchatucci. Both moaning. As if, oh, gotta make it into the cockroach. Gotta make it into the cockroach. Gotta make it in, up, into the, it into the cockroach. Oh, God. Oh, fuck me. Screaming. Is there nobody? And knowing that his greatest fear was also his greatest power. Larry knew it was time to rip through his impregnable dimension. All the places of clicking into place, stories riveting, end was funny upon us. So the cockroach eats them to protect them from the radiation. I get it. But what happens to us? Oh, shit, explosion. This girl miscreants, Mr. Deserters. Dissenters, did you think you could destroy me? Nay, no, this is my bedfellow. Nuclear radiation, a mere gentle kiss upon my back. I cannot die, for I am death. I'm beginning. The end, the Isco groaning, both grass. And Psycho, are we okay? Nothing, an hour long shower. The whiskey in the box won't fix. Is that? No, yes. It's all right, darling. Everyone, this is my daughter Dorothy, Dorothy Spinner. Gary, Larry, oh, guys, I'm going to suggest maybe we deal with the issue at hand here and meet the world's most powerful little girl. Cliff, what the fuck? Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding, kidding me? Are you kidding, fucking kidding me? Kidding me? Kidding me?